I'm now during this run to the finals. This is the first trip back since 2019. They don't lose at home, and in series clinching games, pretty good, 22 and 10. So of course they have their hands full with the Boston Celtics, who are led by Defensive Player of the Year Marcus Smart, Steve Kerr on the seas and Smart. Marcus, uh, I, I described him yesterday as kind of the guard version of Draymond. You know, he's. Um, He's just all over the place defensively, uh, really, really smart, um, anticipates plays, um, understands angles, um, you know, the versatility to guard um, one through five. Um, it's all there. His number one attribute or positive on him coming out of the draft was his leadership and that he's a winner and a true point guard. And the qualities that he has, the quali especially on that side of the ball, are those of a leader. I think he's continued to grow into his leadership. Do you consider yourself an old head now? And, and what does that feel like or look like to you? It is weird. You think about like the age range of guys on this team that are out there and playing. You got 19, 20-year-olds, 34, Raymond's 33, whatever it is, and like you got Life is just different. You appreciate the ability to influence those guys at the time that they're, you know, they're in right now because that will set them up for success. What I like is it's two teams that um, were mostly built with patience and through the draft and uh, development, player development, and, and continuity. And I think that's good for the sport.